From the moment we wake up in the morning, we're using it in some form. We either use heat for its own sake, to heat our bodies and cook our food, or we try to control how it moves from one place to another, or we turn it into some other form of power, like mechanical power. But if we try to fit thermal power into the general concept of power, that is work divided by time, we find that there's no such thing as thermal work. Heat is energy. Once heat is generated, it moves from a warm area to a cold one on its own. Temperature difference is what moves heat, so one way of moving it faster is to increase the temperature difference. But what you're really doing is increasing the rate at which you produce heat energy. In other words, thermal rate and thermal power are defined the same way, and they use the same units. BTUs per hour or calories per second. The difference between thermal rate and thermal power is one of application. Thermal rate is used when we're concerned with the movement of heat energy such as radiators, which try to move it as quickly as possible. And insulators, where we're trying to slow down the rate of heat flow as much as possible. Those are thermal rate applications. Thermal power is used in three situations. The first is where heat energy is produced for its own sake at certain rates, such as in hair dryers and furnaces. The second is when thermal power is converted into other forms of power, such as electricity, which is produced from the thermal power in the furnace of this generating station. The third is when we unintentionally generate thermal power, and it lowers the efficiency of another system because of heat loss. This friend-foe relationship with thermal power is important to consider because it's so common in technology. But whether we call it thermal rate or thermal power, it doesn't matter. The calculations and the units are the same. All machines generate heat, whether it's intentional or not. What is important is to make sure that the right amount of heat energy moves to the right place in the time it's supposed to.